Yes, now bless now. Don't forget the rest now. Des Rocksteady at King of the Pit TV. Yo, we're listening to Nazem. This one is entitled Tested. And from there, we're going to listen to track number 15, which is entitled Shapeshifter. We're not even halfway through the record yet, people. Let's go. Trust as hell. Menacing and grim backing guitar there. I think it's power chords, but it kind of sounded like um, octave chords. Trust punky little number that one. Let's keep it moving, shapeshifter. Hold on to your socks. Come on now. playing with who are they playing with that's what i want to know definitely get on a f couple of half decent tours uh relapse put together let's see if we've got any info right so nazan was formed in 92 by anders jacobson and richard uh Alrickson, two former members of the band necrony all right the band's name latin for nose was taken from the horror film flesh for frankenstein the record label of Necrony offered Nazem a slot on the split 7-inch. The band was featured on the Blind Wall split with... Um, I, I, I don't know how to pronounce that, but I've seen the band referenced uh, quite a lot. What are they? A grind band? I thought it was power violence. Uh, they play a style of grind car, been dubbed Minz car. All right. Um, after several more splits, Nazem released a mini compact disc of their own with Poser Slaughter Records in 95. So that might be what we're listening to. No, it's not what we're listening to now. It's 98, where they released Inhale, Exhale and Relapse. As the band expanded their audience and touring, they recruited a full-time bassist. In early 99, their second album, Human 2.0, was released in April 2000 and followed by two years of touring and performing in support of the work, including a stop-in. Japan. Nazem disbanded a compilation. Grind Finale was released in 2006 in a live album featuring a 2004 show from Osaka. Doombringer was released in early 2008. So that was a live album that they put out together, right? EPs. They put out a few EPs prior to this record, it seems. Compilation appearances, really first volume nine, that's hard, that. 
And they did uh, a tribute to Discharge. They did Visions of War. Right, interesting. Good stuff. Right, let's keep things moving then. A little bit of background history in regards to the band. You know what we do nowadays. We've got um, Feed Em, Kill Em, Skin Em coming up. And we'll follow that through with When Science Fails, track 16 and 17. Hold on to your socks, people. Come on. <laughs> 